in every respect, the crew of a human Mars mission with the full support of mission support and the whole world cheering for them and great rewards awaiting for them in life upon their return is in a vastly superior condition. The Mars Direct crew will spend most of their time inside the two-story HAB, carefully designed to promote psychological well-being despite the confinement. The space where I think everybody would spend the most time, you know, just like a lot of homes on Earth, would be the galley wardroom area. There would be chairs, a table, some kind of large screen for entertainment. You would have individual staterooms about four or five feet wide. The ability for them to communicate with loved ones or with colleagues on Earth, I think, will be almost unlimited. A Mars crew will need to be carefully chosen and thoroughly tested to ensure their ability to handle the extreme isolation. John Young, who went to the moon, used to say that he could cover uh, the Earth by just lifting his thumb up to, uh, up to it. And he says that when you go to Mars, you are going to redefine the concept of loneliness. And so it is very important that the crew be well balanced and well chosen so that they can support each other. 